Hey all here OS Reviews. A few years back we did a review on Leica Mobile's pay-as-you-go plan because it's one of the cheapest prepaid options here in the United States. At that time, calls were only two cents a minute and the plan basically never expired as long as you made a phone call once every few months. So it was even cheaper than T-Mobile's and AT&T's prepaid plans, especially for folks that only make the occasional phone call and just want something for backup or emergency cases. It really was the cheapest option on the market. Now the sad thing is ever since then, the cost for you know running a plan like that has gone up significantly and just a few days ago, Leica Mobile has stopped their pay-as-you-go service altogether. It says in 30 days, the pay-as-you-go service will be disconnected and account balance, regardless of how much is left, will also be wiped. And then back in uh, the 4th of this month, it actually stopped altogether and no more calls were possible. So for a lot of folks out there maybe looking for a replacement, a really low-cost pay-as-you-go service without any required monthly payments, then it seems the options are getting fewer and fewer. And that's part of the reason why I decided to make this video today. It's a review of Truphone. I think this is the second best alternative to Leica Mobile when it comes to cost and could possibly be a new home for all of the Leica Mobile customers out there. So again, if you fall into that boat of not making phone calls that regularly, this could be a you know way to migrate towards. Now, first of all, the cost is a little bit higher than Leica Mobile. Calls are nine cents a minute in the United States and six pence in the UK. Unlike Leica Mobile, Truphone is a international uh, kind of service. So they promise to give you really low calling rates regardless of what country you're in versus if you buy a prepaid plan like Leica mobile and you go to a different country, you have to pay roaming costs. Uh, that is, the price will be a lot higher per minute. So if you also do some traveling, that's where true phone service actually might be even better than Leica Mobile's in terms of the deal. So there's no other kind of fees attached outside of the cents per minute. Uh, so there is no like AT&T charges you a, a dollar for making a phone call a day. True phone doesn't charge that one dollar fee. You can simply make phone calls and again, it's just nine cents a minute. So here's what their website looks like. Now, one of the charges that you do have to keep in mind, though, is to purchase the SIM card. It's a little bit more expensive than some of the other pay-as-you-go networks. But if you plan on staying with Truphone for the next few years, then it could still be a very worthwhile investment. So the SIM card kit sells for $30, and it includes $15 of credit. Uh, so basically, the SIM card is $15 to ship to you uh, versus a lot of, again, T-Mobile or AT&T prepaid SIMs, which you can pick up for maybe five bucks at your local store. One thing I want to point out is uh, some of the other possible replacements for Leica Mobile include the likes of Freedom Pop, it includes the like of Tello, um, other low-cost services do exist. However, those aforementioned services in the United States, Tello and Freedom Pop, both are using CDMA technology, Sprint technology more specifically, which means if you are, uh, you know, someone who has a unlocked smartphone that takes a SIM card, it's not going to be compatible most likely. So you have to get a CDMA phone, which is still a little harder to come across uh, if you're just buying a unlocked phone, especially devices from China, typically are GSM, and that's where Truphone and the previous Leica Mobile came in and worked well because they operate on GSM bands. Truphone in the United States operates on AT&T's cell towers compared to Leica Mobile, which used T-Mobile's towers, by the way. Um, so the, that's a slight difference in terms of coverage. So a closer dive at uh, their calling rates here in the United States, again, nine cents per minute, Incoming calls are actually free, which is really good. And the data is nine cents also per megabyte, which is, you know, for a non-unlimited plan, also average. Um, so text messages also nine cents per outgoing text and the incoming text messages are also free. So if someone is always calling you or texting you, you actually don't have to pay anything. These days, a lot of pay-as-you-go plans are getting closer and closer to just being a contract because uh, they'll often try to advertise on their website or in stores that uh, you don't have to you know sign for two years but you still have to pay say ten dollars or twenty 
$20 or $30 a month versus, again, true pay-as-you-go uh, that I like to think of back in the old days was paying exactly for the amount that you use, uh, which is, again, the cent per minute. You get to pick the area code that you want. So uh, whatever is local to you, you can customize the, you know, the area code of your phone number, which is, again, pretty good. So this is what the packaging looks like. It says One World, One SIM, True Phone. And the packaging is actually pretty fancy. So I can pull this out and the two sides will actually come out from the edges and we have to see sim card here by the way on their website they tell you to choose between the nano micro and full size sim cards but really from my testing it doesn't really matter which option you pick because all of them have pre cutouts for all three of the different sizes so you know whether you pick this nano version or the full size sim they're all pre cut that you can just press out to fit into the mold of your phone the other side says welcome to true phone the network without borders enclosed is your true phone sim has a been activated and good to go. It can still remain active even as an emergency number maybe you stow into the glove compartment of your car for just years and years. The back says change the world, one world, one sim, and if we kind of pull it out on this side, we can see there, there's kind of a phone that uh, pops out, hinting that this allows us to communicate without borders and allows for communication, allows for dating. So um, again, very clever packaging going on here. The experience of using the true phone is, again, not too surprising. Uh, basically, it's again using AT&T cell towers if you're in the United States, which is to say anywhere that you get AT&T reception, this will be just fine. In the Washington area, the cell reception towers for AT&T are actually extremely good, and I constantly got around three bars of reception, usually even around the cities. When it comes to the call quality and the reception quality, I think are all pretty good, AT&T being one of the leaders, especially in the GSM space. The charges for the uh, plan is as advertised, nine cents a minute for calling, which is still, again, one of the cheapest you'll find out of any pay-as-you-go uh, prepaid plan. And you can also check your balance just by calling on the number as aforementioned printed on the back of the documentation. If you contact their customer service, I would say the wait time is also relatively low if you're porting a number. It should be able to get you set up within 30 minutes or so. Of course, the service is not going to be quite as strong as, say, AT&T or T-Mobile that have more staff available, especially in the United States compared to this, which is based in the UK. Uh, but all in all, still not bad, especially considering that the functionality of the service itself is really as expected. It's um, no frills. So that's more or less it just for this uh, quick review of TruePhone. Again, the service itself uh, using the MVO of AT&T here in the United States is really solid and uh, the affordability is also, again, the reason why we're taking a look at it and uh, still remains one of the strongest reasons to pick one up. Although it's a little more expensive now than Leica Mobile, it's basically the second best option for a GSM-based uh, service for pay-as-you-go. So you can check out more details if interested uh, for those reasons in the links down below, but I think it's pretty solid. And of course, TruePhone has the added advantage of having low rates internationally, which I think might even be better for, than Leica Mobile in the long run if you are someone that enjoys traveling and going to different countries. Thanks for watching here at OS Reviews. That's been TruePhone Pay As You Go.